Welcome back. Today's topic is long overdue because it takes us back to the basics of how to position your draft slip designs in the drawing window. Under the View tab in the Navigate section of the ribbon, the Dynamic Pan and Dynamic Zoom icons are located. They both adjust the presentation of your designs to best suit your drawing needs. After selecting the Dynamic Pan feature, your cursor will convert to an open hand in the drawing window. When you left click, the hand will close and allow you to pan or drag the display to your liking. When you right click with the pan icon still selected, DraftSight lists multiple complementary features, including zoom, aka why these operations are dynamic. When you select the zoom function, left click and move your mouse upward. This will increase the view scale of your designs, and vice versa if you drag, drag downwards. If you select Zoom Window, it'll prompt you to left click on the section of your design and drag to make a selection. Then unclick to make the selection boundaries become the new boundaries of your drawing window. This magnifies parts of your entities from the most precision and control while drawing. The Zoom Original and Fit do exactly what their name suggests. They either return your design to its starting viewpoint or perfectly fit your design to the drawing window. So no matter how far away you stray from the standard display, DraftSight will always bring you back to home base in just a couple of clicks. So I hope this video encourages you to take advantage of DraftSight's pan and zoom features. If you're looking to learn more, visit the blog page or visit DraftSight.com.